Okay, well here I have two 6x9 speakers. And these are my old ones, these are Sony's, and even though I call them my old ones, they've never been used. And these are my new ones. And they're Lenzars, and you think, why would you replace them before even using them? Well, here's what these look like. Pretty nice, you know. Nice blue, these are 440 watts, these are the top, top Sony's, you know. And you think, you know, what's so good about these? Well, not much to look at, I mean, they look better, they're prettier. And um, these are 400 watts, not RMS, 400 watts. But these are 100 RMS and these are 200, and I'll just uh, flip them over and uh, show you the difference. So, here's what your top of the range Sony's look like. Okay, so that magnet. And you think, well these Lanzar things can't be much better. But, uh, but, uh, hmm. yeah, let's just have a little look-see there. Besides so those magnets. So here we have the top of the Rain Sony's and my Lanzars, which are fucking huge. 3.2 kilos for a 6x9 speaker. Look at the size of that magnet. That is huge. And look at the size of the magnet on the tweeter. It actually is bigger than the tweeter. And on these Sony's, there's a little tiny magnet compared to them. And as you can see, the tweeter one is that little thing little ring down in there so these things are a boss so I'll just put them on I've got them hooked up to an amplifier which only puts out 50 watts RMS for these channels so these will be at a quarter of what they can put out so this is nothing for them and uh, yeah okay here we go Play me some pippin' man Nuts, eh? <laughs> I love these guys. They are so much better than those. <laughs> Fucking crazy. Anyway, um, yeah, you will enjoy my install when I do it. So I've got these on my back. I'm, I'm quite happy. I've got to get me some decent components for the front. So, you know, 100, 150 watt RMS, something, something solid. And uh, I've got four dual coil 250 watt RMS. 10 inch subs from response. And they all like big blue show car subs. If you see my other vids, you'll see I've got two of them and I've just got another two. And they've cost me uh, nothing all up because I I sold some amps that I bought with them for more than it cost me to buy all of them. So they've actually got cost me nothing at all. And all of these, $22 for the two, including postage. So you gotta love eBay. Anyway, yeah.